take from these practices to join practices? Um, it's good going against another opponent, um, being in camp. You know, uh, just used to our offense and everything. So getting ready for the season, um, going against another opponent is just it's helpful. Mm -hmm. last year, but he was a corner transition to safety. Does he look like a safety out there, or can you still see he's thinking like a corner a little? No, he, he looks like a safety now, but, um, you know, it helps him out when he's playing man-to-man. -man. He's used to playing man now, so that helps him, goes a long way. And then um, he just learning still, um, like we all are, but running fits and stuff is a little different from corner to safety. We didn't play up again. Uh, Marcus back out there, you guys can, you know, be out there at the same time and practice and everything with, you know, his bets. There in the so, do you repeat the question? Lamarcus, yeah. Nice him back oh yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, no, that's you know he's the vet, real vet in the room, so um, I can start asking my questions and stuff too. <laughs> uh, what do you get out of training camp and also the preseason, and uh, how can you clean some stuff up? I guess from mm -hmm. the first preseason game as well. Yeah, you know, um, just being in a new defense for me, uh, you know, I had a little mistake the first game, but. Now it's just like we get those things out the way now so it don't happen in the season. And then, um, like you said, this joint practicing, um, it helps just, you know, different look, different scheme and things like that, uh, jet motions and different types of motions just to get our brain thinking a little bit. So how do you feel, um, how confident are you in this defense now uh, yeah. as opposed to when you first got here? Oh, yeah, it's, you know, every day we, we get better and we're learning. And, um, you know, we're, we're going to get there. It's um, going to happen slowly, but before the season happens, you know, we should be ready to roll. Uh, for sure, yeah, definitely. Um, I just write it down every day, just so I know. Um, it's clear on my mind every day. But yeah, once it happens once, it can't happen again. Head coach over obviously oversee everything, but is it any different playing for a defensive-minded head coach like Robert than it was for like Bruce, who obviously is offensive? Oh, uh, things that how they did in Tampa, because uh, Bowles, Todd Bowles was the defensive coordinator. He was kind of like. We was around him all day, so it was kind of just a weird situation how they handled it. But um, you know, it is different because you know I go to now I go to Salah, and he's on the offensive side, so I gotta wait to ask my questions sometimes. But um, they have a lot of good, you know, Brick and M with the um, assistant coaches helping us out. So we were just talking to Salah, and he said sometimes in free agency a guy just for whatever reason gets out of the building. You know, a team lets him go to market, and obviously that happened with you. Is, was that perplexing? I mean, that you know, a good player like yourself was allowed to get to market, and then I mean, um, it didn't work out. The Jets seemed to be happy. So I wasn't, you know, I just kind of take care of what I could take care of, just play ball, make my plays, and help the team out. And then once we get to see, I wasn't thinking about it until after the season. And once it hit, uh, I just let God take control. What are your Oh, everything that I've heard, everything that I've seen in the past, um, energy. You know, he does a great job of just bringing the team together. And then uh, he always says that he's a, he's a defense-sided coach, so he's hard not to celebrate for the defense. So, you know, we're just ready to get into the first game and uh, do this all together. He's got a lot of expression saying and things that he's Do you like that stuff? Oh, yeah, yeah. They do a great job just uh, – Coach Salad does a great job of, you know, implementing, a, you know, what he's trying to uh, tell the team. And he gives us, like, something every day that we just walk away with. Oh yeah, that's uh, you know, DJ vet been in the game for a long time, and then Sauce, the young rookie, just learning. But you wouldn't even think he's a rookie out there. Can't forget about Bryce Hall too. You know, he's doing a great job and uh, competing. Oh, just saying that he's undecided on how he's going to play Monday night, so he conceivably can rest the starters. He said, uh, as a starter, like, do you need a certain amount of reps in the preseason to get ready, or like, what's the ideal setup for you? Uh, I know. Er Everybody does it different, but, you know, our practice reps, our joint practices is kind of just like, you know, it's the preseason. It's, it's the preseason game is just like practice, really. Um, we're getting the amount of reps. We're changing up things, different disguises and different schemes. So uh, it definitely helps out, and it definitely speeds up. And when you do get into the game, it speeds up a little bit, so you definitely need some reps to get ready for the season. Hey. Uh, did Uh, I never said anything about that, but <laughs> I'm going to ask him about it. <laughs>